I never, never had doubts. All my family, mum and dad, nothing but supportive, no matter what. I had fuck all money, you know what I mean? Like, nothing, they've just always been absolutely supportive. What they've been like is, right, if you're passionate about what you do, then we're here to support you, that's it. I don't know, my dad's always just kind of brought me up to, to consider skateboarding as a hobby. And obviously, if it becomes a profession, then that's the best, the best thing ever. But if you take it too seriously, then it's just not going to be fun. I don't feel like I've ever a precise moment. When I've most been like, right, okay, I need to skate, is when I've had people that I've looked up to my whole life giving me an opportunity. That's when I'm like, oh, God, all right. This is the thing I feel a bit strange about skateboarding. In this weird way, there's like these weird rules that are put in place. Like, I fully don't agree with it at all. Like, for instance, people that longboard, like, all oh, right, they they longboard, whatever. Like, them lot, they're on four wheels. Mark Gonzalez, he rides longboards all the time, but you lot think he's the best guy ever. He is, but I just don't get. It's kind of like the more and more I'm grown up, the more and more I'm starting to be like, the reason why I like found skateboarding so appealing was because. You know, you watch all the 411 videos and it's just like, everyone's having fun and it's crazy and there's no rules and there's loads of different people from different areas and different walks of life or whatever. Just like having fun and there's no rules, but skateboarding's sick, just have some fun, like. <laughs>